Mold home testing is always a difficult topic. The ERMI is the industry standard. Those units where we were cut collecting dust in the middle of the room, the Petri dishes, mold dogs, these are all options out there. But the ERMI is the industry standard. This is a test where they're testing for mold DNA by using a collection from dust and carpet. So what you're looking for is as it is collecting, as those spores are collecting on the ground, it gets vacuumed up and put into a bag so that you can send it to a lab and see if mold is accumulating. This accumulated mold then gets sent back to you with a score. The score being anywhere between negative 10 and 20. You want to be somewhere at the lower end of the single digits. There's a lot of controversy on what is perfect. So is it one, is it two, is it 10? Well, the main thing that we know is that you want to be at the low end of the single digits. If you're extremely sensitive, if you have chronic inflammatory response syndrome, you might even need to be at the zero mark. But for most of us that are not extreme sensitive or that have recovered, somewhere between five and 10 is survivable and okay and not gonna do as much harm. Again, controversial topic, but finding a home that is absolutely perfect zero is gonna be extremely difficult for most people. So for me, the goal is again, let's heal, let's not get stuck in the, I have to find a place that is absolutely zero on mold because that can be nearly impossible, extremely stressful, and sometimes unrealistic. Now, the other piece of this pie is the ERMI or any mold testing for your home is only as good as the fact that you found where the mold was, collected it, sent it into a lab, and got a positive result. So how you can compound different tests is do the mold mycotox internal test along with the ERMI test at the same time to see if your body is expelling mold while your house has got mold in it. If they're positive one or the other, they can give you more information about maybe the struggles that you're having. Hope this helps. Hope you're enjoying all these videos. Hope the units are teaching you. If you have any questions, post them to the group.